it's it's devastating to deal with the disease, but in the same token, um, our treatments have come so far that our patients just, they're doing so much better than they've ever done before. Aphasia really is a disorder where people have communication problems, not necessarily intellectual problems. I always said if I could change the life of one child, then my career goals have been met. Well then it was, well, if I can change the lives of this whole age group of children, then my career goals have been met. So I think I'm driven to mentor students every day, but I'm also driven to, to really make a difference in the way kids get treatment. many cases, but one that always sticks with me is a guy who, who never wanted to do anything with this implantable bone conduction device that we deal with. And it, we, it, we have to put it back here behind the head. And he was resistant, didn't like the look of it, didn't want this in his head. And then one day we finally got him to surgery and then we connected him. And he said he went out to the parking lot, and this is a biker guy with tassels on his jacket, rough looking guy, and he sat in the parking lot and cried for a half an hour about being able to hear birds chirping on the wires, being able to hear gravel crunching under the tires. And this to me is, this was a two o'clock appointment on a Friday afternoon, this was just run of the mill stuff, but it completely changed his life. And that to me is the, the biggest privilege of, of doing this. Even though the type of research I do, trying to understand the brain and its function and speech production and stuttering seems quite far removed from what goes on in the clinic. I, the dissemination of my research results I think really helps clinicians explain to families uh, what's happening uh, with their child when they find out that they're stuttering. We know for sure now that we can put a lot of the old myths about stuttering uh, to rest. Yeah, I don't have the dilemma in a lot of my jobs that I think many people do of, you know, sort of a good and evil kind of thing or, you know, um, really this is, there aren't very many parts of what we do that aren't good somehow. Students might disagree around exam time, but it's all about helping people have better quality of life.